Hey, do you believe in ghosts? Do you believe in life after death? What if all your dreams and nightmares are pieces of a puzzle you once knew? A place and time waiting for us in the heavens. What if all this isn't real? Are you? Join me as I go looking for answers. YouTube, what's up you guys? Welcome to another haunted adventure. Tonight guys, I'm in Jackson, California. I'm at the Victorian style National Historic Hotel in Jackson. This place is super old, super cool. It's a very beautiful place. Now, during the gold rush, this hotel was built pretty much during the gold rush. And then in the 1900s, it caught on fire twice. The first time it was damaged somewhat. And then the second time it almost got burned down completely, but they restored it. And it was also used, you know, during the prohibition if I'm saying it correctly, but it was used as a legal prostitution place in a brothel. They also did a lot of illegal, you know, selling of alcohol. So when they raided the place, I think they pulled out like so many barrels of liquor and wine and they find the hotel 500 bucks. That was back then. Can you imagine now you probably do some serious prison time. They also say this place used to be a hospital and who knows if people died here. But what's really cool about this place, it's haunted. You know, they say there's actually paranormal activity that occurs here. So I read about a spirit named Flo. You know, um, her husband got into a fight downstairs with some drunk guy and he was shot. A few weeks later, they found her dead upstairs facing the window and she was all dressed in a wedding gown. Now they say that she had a heart attack while she was putting on makeup or something. Nobody really knows. But they say flow is a friendly spirit. I'm here to catch any spirit that wants to come through. So guys, without further ado, let's get right into it. Time for some action. Hopefully I'll catch something. Let's do this, guys. That's the National Hotel, established 1852. Beautiful place. Very quiet out here. I mean, even all these buildings around here, man, like I wouldn't be surprised if all these buildings have some kind of residual energy, you know, from the past. I do believe in these things. I really do believe this hotel is haunted. Just look at it. It's amazing. <coughs> Over here, guys. Look at that. Goes down to some antique store and then I was looking at this building right here this is not part of the hotel but man look at this it looks spooky guys like all this furniture they sell here you never know man could have attachments so you always you always have to be careful when you buy this stuff Here are the windows. So I'm trying to make contact with the spirits. I got my green light.
So I have access to this place, guys. I have full permission to investigate this whole area. All right, guys, before we continue the investigation, you know, as I was going downstairs, you know, I already had this strange feeling, but I really thought I saw something move behind the door. I really don't know what this is, but it does look like somebody's moved out of the way or something was looking at me. But yeah, you know, um, here's a picture. I took a screenshot of it. I enhanced it. Kind of looks like somebody's standing there. Pretty creepy if you ask me. But other than that, if to me, I, I would say it's an amazing capture. You know, it does look like a face. It does look like somebody's standing there. So hopefully we'll capture something in this area. I don't know if we'll capture anything, but hopefully we do. I mean feels different down here because I'm all by myself. So I'm going to set up right here and I'm going to investigate and maybe we'll make contact with the spirit of flow or any other spirits that want to come through. Look at all those paintings. And that goes downstairs. I don't know if that's a basement, but I can't go down there. What is that? Oh, it's like a bar room. Are there any spirits down there? Can you make a knocking sound? Hello? Hello? Can you move that chair? Are there any spirits in this room that want to make contact with me? My name's Mike. Can you swing that light? It's a whole different feeling down here, guys. Look at that picture. Wow. Can you make a knocking sound? Like she's looking at us she's like what are you doing down here i just came to say hi i'm actually kind of scared i don't know why this right here is a cat ball that's all it is but it has lights in it so the idea is that if you put it down there A spirit can make this move. So all they have to do is either touch it or manipulate it. So I'm going to set up my necrophonic app. And then we're going to do a session in here and we're going to go lights out. So I'm only going to do like 15 minutes. And then I'm going to go upstairs to my room. And I'm going to try to make contact with the other side. I don't know why these are here, but they look kind of trippy. <coughs> so I'm thinking I'll grab a chair right here. If you're here with me, I put a ball on the table. You can um, go touch that device and you can make it light up. I also put this device right there. You can make that light up if you want to talk to me. You see that guys? 
Oh, my heart's starting to beat. If that was you, can you make that go off again? Wow. Thank you. Guys. I know I'm getting that. This is amazing, guys. Look at that, guys. Can you turn that off? Please? Wow, guys. I've never seen that in my life. Look at that, guys. <clears throat> oh. This place is legit, bro. Look at that. I'm too scared to turn off the lights now. <laughs> hang on, hang on. I brought my necrophonic app. We're going to talk, okay? You can turn that off now. You can turn it off. I have something you can talk to me with. Is the spirit of flow here? Guys, it's not supposed to be doing that. Look at that. Flow, if you're here, can you make that go off again? If you're the owner, can you make that go off, sir? Sir, I come all the way from Texas. Did you find gold here while you were here? Can you make that light up if you did? So it's not doing anything, guys. That is, that is amazing. I don't even know if I want to turn off the lights now. <laughs> I have two devices on the table. You can make him light up whenever you want. That lets me know that you're here. Okay? So I'm going to turn on my device so we can talk. I just turned on my necrophonic app. I'm going to start it. I got the speaker right underneath it. Are there any spirits here that want to talk to me? Henry, is that you? Henry, if that was you, can you make that light go off again? So I'm going to go lights off, guys. I'm going to leave that room. If there's any spirits in here with me, flow, the wonderful friendly spirit. If you're here, can you give me a sign? Is the owner of the National Historic Hotel here with me? Can you roll that ball or make it light up? Are there any ladies here? Knock, knock. Knock, knock. Can y'all hear me? Can 
Can you can you move something? Can you knock on something? Can you say hello, Mike? Guys, I'm, I'm, I'm trying to feel very weird. Like someone's really trying to talk to me. And the hairs on my neck just stood up. I'm not playing. Are you here with me? One. Listen, I'm, I'm not scared of you guys. I want to talk to you. Can you make that light up? I can hear you. What's your name? Are there any miners down here from the gold rush? Do you remember the gold rush? Do you remember this being a brothel? Did you make a lot of love here? How much did you pay for a good time? Any guys want to tell me? Did you pay with gold? Do you guys remember the fire? I don't know if that's the AC blowing on those crystals. On the chandelier. If you're here, can you make that ball light up again? Can you roll it towards me? Can you knock? Knock, knock. Nice to meet you. My name's Mike. Hello? You're here? What's your name? I'm here for a good time. Can you talk to me? How much are we talking, huh? Pretty lady? I'm hearing sounds, guys. Can you say hello, Mike? Hello? Are you guys talking amongst each other? Are you at peace? Is the spirit of flow here with me? I hear she's very beautiful and friendly. Flo, are you here? Flo, if you're here, can you make that ball turn colors again? I'm getting creeped out, guys. <laughs> Flo, touch that ball, Flo. Is there any lovely spirit that wants to communicate with me? Can you touch that ball? Make it light up one more time. If you make it light up, I'll leave. How many spirits are here with me? Two? Five? Who do I have the pleasure of speaking with? Hello?
<laughs> Did you die in the fire? Did someone kill you over the gold? Are you at peace? Are you okay? I don't know guys, it feels weird. Why don't you make that ball light up like you did earlier? Show me something, come on. Show me you have energy. Make that light up, come on. Can you move something? That was crazy, guys. Hello? Oh. Holy crap. Hello? I'm here. Talk to me. Talk to me, come on. Go touch that ball. Touch that ball like you did. That was crazy, guys. I heard my name. I heard my name. Did you say my name, Mike? I was nuts. That thing was not supposed to be lighting up. Look, it's not doing nothing anymore. But the minute I sat down, it's like something wanted to talk to me. But I can't make them talk when I want them to talk. They talk when they want to. They're just like human, you know, they're just like us, but in, in a different realm. Look. That's nuts. I'm too scared to turn off the lights now. <laughs> Just in case something tries to push me or appear behind me, I don't know. That was nuts, guys. That was crazy, guys. There's no way in hell that ball should have lit up after it turned off like that and just go nuts for a while. And then when I wanted to talk, it's like, it's up to them, you know? I was freaking out for a second, man. Like, wow, I love that feeling, though. That's why I do this. Is anyone here? So this is what I mean, guys. Downstairs, and we saw earlier. That ball was going crazy, and it's not doing anything right now. <clears throat> it's just idle. Everything's idle. So it tells me that this room is very peaceful. I mean, I'm not picking up anything. 
Hey you guys, thanks again for watching my videos. You guys are awesome. I really appreciate it. You're the best. Help my channel grow. Subscribe. You know, hit me up with some comments. I love talking to people. But yeah, you know, I woke up in the middle of the night and I decided to turn on my phone and record for a few minutes and just to see if I would capture anything. Something interesting did happen. I captured what seems to be like an orb that swings around the mirror, goes up towards me, comes down, and then hits the bed and it makes this thumping sound. Now, some of these other things you see flying by, they could simply be tiny dust particles. That doesn't mean the hotel is dirty. It's a beautiful place. I highly suggest if you're ever in Jackson, California, come check it out. It's one of the most amazing places I've been in. It's a wonderful place to stay. Very comfortable beds. The people there are amazing. They treat you like family. I had a great time. But yep, here's the clip, guys. I hope you enjoy.